previously on the Vampire Diaries. The government is playing some game in Europe. Yeah, what comes to the time? This place is not safe. I'm even scared. We just take your ten minutes to talk. To talk up here. Yeah. I don't. I don't like this situation. Yeah. To manage safety. Safety first. Hapo kwenye nivo. Now, ladies and gentlemen, this is the most dangerous bridge I have ever seen in Eastern Central Africa. This is an extremely dangerous bridge. In fact, we've decided we are not going to record while stepping on the bridge. I'm going to show you just how dangerous this bridge is. But before I show you that, I'd like uh, Engineer Evans Kimori to just say a word. In fact, to me, this is a gigantic tragedy of the highest proportion in the 21st century as far as safety is concerned. As you can see, that is the old bridge. Vehicles are avoiding this bridge. Come, let us, let us happen. They are avoiding this bridge. That is somehow called complete. Because it is not safe. They are passing through the old bridge because there is no barrier that, has, that, that the contractor on site could have installed this bridge. What the contractor could have done, he could have put a precast barrier as temporary measures to enhance safety. I'm imagining a pedestrian crossing this path. Supposedly, there is a catastrophic accident that could have happened here. The safety of the bridge is not engineering standard. That is the first failure. The second failure, when you look at the, the dense bituminous macadam that was installed here, even if anyone can drive along this road, Sukwala Punja Road, the levels are not to engineering standard. I can satisfy as a trained engineer. This is shoddy work. Let's, let's walk through. We cannot reach the center of the bridge. This is where the abutment of the bridge starts. We cannot reach there because it is quite unsafe. So, President Ruto should be able to, to take full responsibility. So now you see. Look how unsafe this place is. This bridge is not a big deal. You can see how big that river is. Extremely big. And it's a fast moving river. Not only and that, a very deep river. It is moving with. Water has buoyancy. It can be carried up to 100. a lot of load. So I'm imagining anyone by mistake. Anybody who falls here will die. It's a, it's a gold case. So, at a gari, if you are off the road, in Anguka to Kwamachi, this is another crime scene. Because this is what I want to ask the contractor who was building this road. You've been paid 1.8 billion to pay this road. You just did this small repair because President Ruto was passing through this place to go to Opio and I is a homecoming. Why wouldn't you put a temporary precast barrier on this a barrier? On this bridge, before you do the guardrails, when you are watch a bridge open Namnai, now the bridge can kill so many people. I think the kind of mediocrity and jokes that it is in, in our public works ministry and ministry of transport in terms of doing very shoddy work and work that cannot, you know, be to any standard whatsoever, is shocking and it's appalling. I don't know what my friend uh, Joshua Kaya wants to say. He can say something because... Joshua Kaya said something. Prepared. I want to add something that maybe Kenyans think we are lying. Before we leave here, we will record the newly constructed bridge road that is just crossing the river for the president to be able to pass and the other roads. Then you, as you move along the bridge, it is so imbalanced. In terms of the levels are not to engineering standards. So anyone around the country can come and cross and check for himself. This is a crime scene. That's what we are talking about. Thank you. Proceed. 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 Uh, as you guys were talking about this, because I'm moving around. And Barabara Mnasema in Ongezwa, I think it's just about 150 meters or 200. Now, Apo Alieta Kutunagani. This place, and we have not even looked at Bona Bona before Barabara. I'm confused and I'm here with the Yeah. Mm -hmm. this, is like, this place is so risky, even for us. 
to go up and like you are just looking behind because you don't know what will happen next. Actually, this thing, I'm not even sure how it's going to feel that was wrong. So honestly, up and the wheezy wheezy thing, you know, that was never. Wheezy wheezy villa, Kazi. Wheezy wheezy villa, Kazi. Wheezy wheezy villa, Kazi. Ruto is doing nothing, he's lying to us. He's launching projects at Mazwa Ziko. And this, Nali Pita Apa. 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 1.8 billion Kenya shillings. Look wow. at the mixture, look, look at the mixture of the bitumen. Look, the videos in the Kuja Zikamuagua, and the quality of the Kuja Zikamuagua. Show the job. Useless. Wow. Look, look, you can record it there. Eh? It's a very dangerous bridge. Hmm? It's an extremely dangerous bridge. How, how do you build a bridge without guardrails in such a big river? Ah, in him, Cheso. Even even the cars here, they fear this bridge.